Every app you make in App Inventor is composed of screens. The first screen that loads in every app is called Screen 1. And you can't really rename Screen 1. You can, you can change the title. If you look at the Screen 1 properties, you can change the title of Screen 1 to anything you want. And that will change what displays here. But that doesn't change the title of Screen 1. If you want to have an app that opens multiple screens, maybe you want to have a button that says Continue. And when you click the Continue button, you want Screen 2 to load. You do that by clicking this Add Screen button and giving it another name. Now, Screen 1, Screen 2, Screen 3 are not very descriptive names for your screens. You might say Screen Detail or Screen whatever, whatever the screen is for. Give it a, a reasonable name. So I've called mine Screen Detail. Notice that I've capitalized the S and the D. After saying OK, App Inventor is going to open that second screen where I can add content. Just so we can tell we did it, I'm going to add a label and I'm going to make the text size of that label a bit larger. And I'm going to change the text that appears to say Detail Screen. So now we've made it. So this is Detail Screen. You can switch between screens here with this button. I'm going to go back to Screen 1 and now let's look in the blocks and see how we open this other screen. Under control, near the bottom, is a block called open another screen. And it wants to know the name of the screen, which is text. We named that other screen screen detail. And if we want that to happen when the button is pressed, I can say when button 1 is clicked, open screen detail. If I look in my emulator, I press the continue button. Notice in the background that it takes a minute to load, but there screen detail comes. So that's how you do multiple screens in App Inventor.